bitch. It's seven o'clock now. It's Friday. I'm tired. This is from Shein, by the way. I got bra pads just because I know a lot of people don't like wearing pads. I personally do. And it's just been so hot here in Texas where I just cannot wear a bra with a lot of my tops just because it's so hot. So then I saw Shein had these and I think that worked just fine. They're a little bit push up. So they'll give the little girls a boost, which I'm excited to try these out. And then I got two like little summer dresses what well, one's really a summer dress the other one isn't i really don't know why i bought this dress just because it's literally vegas vibes and then this one gives me like beach vacation vibes oh why did i think this was knit okay i thought this was a knit dress but it looked really cute online it's just like one of those cutout dresses but i thought it was knit so a little bit disappointed but also a little bit not because maybe this fabric is a little bit better for the summer anyways rather than knit. That's my little haul. Welcome to this weekend in my life vlog. Getting ready to go out. Let's try these on. Oh, you can see them. They're not compressed enough. Oh, dang it. Push-up was a bad idea. You can see the lines. Because they were literally made to like wear under a bra, I guess, for an extra push up. That was a flop. The sticky boob like isn't any better. It's just a little less obvious than the pads. That's why I was like thinking like the pads would have covered more and not just like a circle. That's fine. That's fine. It will do. It's Saturday. I've had a really chill morning. Honestly, I feel like... My body just needs coffee. Not because I didn't sleep, but just because I think I became so dependent on it. But yeah, I had a real chill morning. I'm doing laundry right now. I washed my hair, had a nice shower, cleaned up my room a little bit, and I just made lunch. I just bought bagels again, and I attempted to air fry my bagels because I don't have my toaster oven, and I like them toasted. I tried to air fry it, and it looks like it did the job. She's like, nice and hard. <laughs> Maybe I made her a little too crunchy. Just a little bit. Okay guys, I wanted to show you guys some stuff from Body Fit Shape that you guys will probably see me wear on like vacation or when I'm working out and stuff. I do have some leggings and swimsuits to show you guys. I have all these leggings. They're super good quality leggings. They're super thick and compressed. And they even have the butt scrunch that we all know and love. And it's all the super popular, I wouldn't call it, it's not tie-dye, marble print. That's super popular right now. I have the pink one, the blue one, light blue one. And I would say like this different shade, blue-green color. And I got all the leggings in a small if you're wondering. So I'll show you guys my first reaction when I was trying them on. I'm 5'1", by the way, and they're just a tad bit too long but not too bad i think they make the butt look really good very comfortable and really stretchy i really like how like stretchy they are i think this is so fun so i have a variety of swimsuits to show you guys all the swimsuits are also in a small so the first thing i got was this swimsuit bright pink so it's out of my comfort zone but i just wanted something a pop of color so it's really this really pretty one piece swimsuit really good quality it has ruffles and it has a deep dip in the back with ruffles still. Super good coverage if you're into that. And this one fit pretty good on me. The next one piece is this purple color. I don't have a purple color yet and it's this really fun texture. I don't know what it's called, but it's a fun texture. Really like the color. Fits really good. There's a cutout on the side, which I think is super flattering. Also on the more full coverage side, bottom which i personally don't mind so for this bikini set this one's a high-waisted bikini and it's a triangle top got this in a small i would say to go up a size although the cups did fit me really really well the band itself was kind of small and it was like stretching to fit but the cups fit really well and it was this dark green color and the bottoms fit really well also on the more full coverage side the last swimsuit is also one piece but i think this one's super fun because this is the front you guys probably think like whoa scandalous these are the cups 
a long string there's a lot of ways you can tie the swimsuit which is the fun part definitely something you don't want to like tan in because you'll probably get a bunch of different tan lines but it's still a super fun swimsuit this one's probably the most cheekiest one out of all the one pieces last but not least if you guys are into undergarments and what to wear to like snatch yourself up so this one you could wear like under a dress this one's really really good quality it will snatch you right up i have a coupon code for you guys i'll put it on the screen and currently they're having a deal if you buy at least two items you'll get the third one free on all of their collections so hopefully you guys will check them out everything i just mentioned will be linked down below and this hair will not go down I just finished getting ready. We're going on a double date today with my friend Sam. One of my only few friends in the DFW area. So today's fits is this top from Zara. My go-to shorts this summer have been these Pac Sun shorts. Like they're like little mom shorts. And I literally like never touch them. I've probably worn them like once or twice before coming here this summer and i've been wearing them non-stop they're like my go-to shorts at the moment which is crazy so we're downtown fort worth we're around like the sundance square area yeah, it's adorable oh this is so cute we're just walking and exploring because our table's not right until 1 30. yeah you should get a photo around here hi sam they've never seen you before oh, yeah. <laughs> this is sam <laughs> she's my chemi bestie <laughs> Like a, it looks good. I got a skillet with some eggs and I don't know what this is. These are tiny, mm -hmm. but the fork is so <laughs> <laughs> The proportions are off. Like, this is like a mason jar for a baby. Let's do a little haul. I got some green bell peppers, bread, charcuterie, meat and cheese, two wines, pork chops, some ground beef, potatoes, and carrots. Let's put it away.